Hello my friends and welcome to another Tuesday of Tutorial. I am Leonardo Perez Nieto and today I'm taking on a fun challenge that consists of drawing the same subject three times, but the first one has a time limit of 10 minutes, the second one one minute, and the third one just 10 seconds. <laughs> This challenge was launched originally by my friend, the legendary Mark Creeley. Let's give it a try. I divided the paper in three for the three drawings. And I placed my phone with the timer set at 10 minutes here. I'll use this reference photo of the Falcon. Ready? And let's get started. 10 minutes, oh my god. I would have asked at least for half an hour to draw that falcon. To draw it really well, maybe two hours. I start slowly and carefully with the beak. I don't want to rush this part because I think it's the most important one. The beak and the head. After I do those two things, I plan to catch up. I hope I will be able to. I'm getting a little nervous and I speed up the video a little bit, so as to not make it too long. Okay, so we have the head, let's do the neck and the body this way. All right. I need to begin hurrying here. The eye, which has this line very prominently, and these creatures have really big eyes, big and intense, beautiful eyes, a beautiful bird actually. I draw it black, leaving the little white reflection, this uh, dark feather under the eye, the shadow under the beak, sometimes the shadows and the marks like the feathers help me to start gauging the proportions like how low I need to go for the wing or how wide for the body. This thing is on my way. I need to really speed up now, I'm behind. And I make the head wider in this way because it looked like a pigeon head. All right, let's draw the body that comes from here, down, curving in, more or less like this, and then the other wing from here. Normally, I'm very relaxed when I draw, but today, with this timer which is in front of me ticking down by the second, I'm a bit freaking out. <laughs> However, this is fun. What do you think? The claws. And maybe I'm doing too much detail before sketching the rest. And I'll do some shading of this wing with a suggestion of darker feathers and also some shading here and let's darken the tip of the beak. After this I'll do some indication of the feathers of the wing, just rapidly. All the other YouTubers, by the way, that I have seen doing this challenge drew a cartoon. Maybe it was a little foolish on my part to choose a realistic subject with a lot of detail. I thought I could get it done, but now I see that I'm running out of time and I'm not even close. But I'll hurry. Let's give it a last sprint. Let's draw these four feathers of the wing that is behind. I make it dark. And I'll do a little shading here and some darker little feathers. I'm not even going to attempt to do all the detail that he has. And the head is even wider over here. Still pigeon head. <laughs> That's a little better. This feather that sticks out. And the tail. In some very rapid shading, just like this, so that it has a tone. Because the wing is darker than the body but it projects a shadow here. Quickly, quickly! Oh my god, it's over. Oh no. I never even stepped back to look at it from a little distance. Now I see that I should have done the head on top flatter, still wider on the right, the wings longer further down, and the hand holding it 
I made it so small, it's almost ridiculous. Oh no. Okay, we'll leave it like that. Let's set the timer to one minute now. <laughs> one minute? All right. Let's move this out of the way. But before starting, I need to loosen up a little. I'm so tense. I can't believe I need to do this in one minute. Okay, good. Let's get ready, set, go! And I still will use the tactic of going slow for the beak and the head. All of this one will be in real time, of course. This is the bone just above the eye, and the eye, which as I said is so important. I'll fill it in, even though that's probably the only thing I will fill in. The head. Oh my god, we're almost halfway. I really need to speed up. Now I'm freaking out. <laughs> okay, the body goes this way. And the right side of the wind here goes down like this with the feathers. 20 seconds. The body and the other wing. One leg. The second leg. At least it has two legs. The feet, claws. And the glove, five seconds. Oh my God, where is the lower part of the other wing and the tail? Here, here. Uh, I think I went over time one or two seconds. Does it look like a falcon to you? <laughs> I didn't get to do any shading. Okay. I need to move this to draw on the right. Uh, maybe not here. Let's place it here between the two. And let's give it 10 seconds. Zero minutes and ten seconds. Oh no. Let's see how am I going to do this. Let's get the hand ready in place and with the other one I'll get it started. Ready, set, go! Quickly, quickly! Five seconds! One wing, the other one, the glove! Oh no! This is a tailless falcon that looks that has been pumping up in the gym. <laughs> oh, this is ugly. I wish I could do it again. But anyhow, this is how it went. I hope you had fun. And please let me know if you would like me to take another challenge like this, because truly, I'm not very happy with it. And I would like to give it another go in a few weeks. And if you enjoyed it, please give it a like, share it to your friends, and subscribe to Finer Tips. And I will see you on Tuesday.